<laughs> we sp yeah, peace out. Have a good night. Right. I'll see you. I'll see you tomorrow, we, girl. We out here. I'll see you tomorrow, girl. We out here. That's been the episode. And we got to jump. Three, two, one. Welcome back to episode four of Men at Work. We are here at WrestleMania, the epicenter of the wrestling world, WrestleMania 40. We've got Cody Rose. We've got Dwayne The Rock Johnson. We've got Seth Rollins. We've got Roman Reigns. I'm Kyle. And Maddie. I did not know how much you loved wrestling, dude, did you? <laughs> they're calling me the top 10 wrestling fan in the Northeast. You've heard wow. this? Wow. It's, it's unbelievable, dude. I've studied it as a young man. I know all the guys, the one guy, the bigger guy, the little or tiny guy. <laughs> so it's good to be here seeing a lot of my idols in the flesh. And I dress up as one of my, my biggest idols, Stone Cold Cheese Omelet. It's half a Steve Austin. It's more of a cheese omelet kind of thing. And uh, we both were supposed to be dressing up today. And I'm kind of wondering if I could see the costume at some point, dude. <laughs> I was supposed to be Randy... Macho Man Savage. You were supposed to, yes. I I, I, I put the I put the order in the cart, <laughs> delivered here Thursday. <laughs> I went down to go get it. They left it outside my apartment. It got stolen. It legitimately got stolen. I will show you the receipts after the pod is over. I just <laughs> it's on a crackhead somewhere. Okay. And he's just <laughs> like, oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, He's yeah. been saying that for a while. I'll tell you what, I thought it was going to be something much more nefarious. I thought you just were like, I'm going to make this guy dress like a complete no. asshole and not get anything. So I can live with that. No, my, yeah. my head was in the right. That guy just scared the <laughs> shit out of me. You can't eat us when we're mid-conversation, dude. We're just a couple of... Is that a salt? Uh, it's more of a pepper. But, yeah. <laughs> but yes, yeah, I, I like to think that there's a crackhead around Philadelphia somewhere. Every time someone throws a quarter in his... Uh, in his uh, in his cup, he's just like, oh yeah. What do you pay for a thing like that? What's the going rate? For uh, I pay like sixty two dollars oh for it. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah, yeah. Oh, right. dude, uh, Daddy Bezos will get back to me. Yeah. Hey, you want to sit down? Want to hang out? Talk on the podcast? We won't hold you too long. Uh, dude, you got an hour and a half to get there. No, you got a big no. Oh, so this is my this is my favorite belt. This is the Attitude Era one, and like no prints. This was like 500 bucks. And these and people spend a lot of money. Like there's like the limited edition ones. And like How much was this, Matt? Yeah, we got the same thing. That was about that was anywhere from fifteen to five hundred dollars. It, it does look good. It's yeah. definitely yeah. worth it. But no, but like, you know, people you ask for a picture of people's belts, they take it, they have no problems yeah. taking it off and like you can walk around with it, they yeah. don't care. And yeah, I mean that's a, that's the beauty part about the WWE universe. I mean we're in Philadelphia, I'm a Jack fan, I'm from New York. You hear a lot about these Philadelphia fans. You know that you know the reputation that they bring. Yeah. What do you think so far? Uh, I mean, these people have been nothing but welcoming. Yeah. You know? That's it. This is, I'm feeling the brotherly love in Philly. There you go. So that's that's the honest truth. There you go. Turn of events, dude. Yeah. Now, just a quick question. You just got this today. Do you have a lady at home or anything like that? Yeah, I do. So, are you ever gonna bust this thing out just you butt naked with just the belt on for her? Uh, one thousand percent. So one thousand. That's yeah. my mommy. Yeah. yeah. That's my mommy. Yeah, of course. And mommy's always on top. Yeah. Uh, but I am that great kid, that that sexy boy. Yeah. So obviously I'm gonna wear that. And the beauty part about my girlfriend is that for my anniversary, she actually got me tickets for Raw last Monday night. Mm. So that's how I spent uh, my my anniversary. Wow. It was great. For Did you go Raw on your anniversary? Yeah. No, nice. Our anniversary is on Easter, but we went on uh, the, the first. Yeah. Which, yeah our, but we, we did the we did the uh, the day after. It was awesome. It was Talk about a tombstone that couldn't put someone down. <laughs> Jesus Christ. He rose for three days straight. Yeah. Dude, rock hard. Yeah. yeah. It was good. Man. So how heavy is this bad boy? Can we can we put the strap over our shoulder? If you don't mind, please. Oh my God. Oh my God. To oh, yeah. it. it's, it's a little heavy. No. Buddy, put it, put it on like you're, no, like you're yeah. actually stone no, cold and you've actually you you had the, the strap belt, before. Burn the belt. How you doing, brother? Things yeah. like that, you know what I mean? Hey, Stuff like that? You yeah. Like, Here you go, Kyle. Get, 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 some, get some hands on that. Come on, Kyle. Get on there. Yeah, this is pretty heavy. Yeah, it's pretty heavy. Jesus Christ. Can I, can I smack the plate or no? Go for it. Yeah? I don't want to go smack the plate. I've been doing it all night. Ooh. Yeah. That's a real man. This feels natural. It does feel, it looks natural. It feels natural. It looks natural. You change that eagle to a jet, it looks even more yeah. natural. Uh, it looks even more natural. It. Hey, come on, go Jets. What's your favorite <laughs> WrestleMania moment ever? Oh, God, my favorite WrestleMania moment ever. Honestly, I'm a big fan of WrestleMania. I think it was, was it 20 or 21 when they were in uh, Hollywood the first time. That WrestleMania all together was really cool. WrestleMania 2000, the TLC, obviously. The oh, that was the tables, ladders, and chairs with the yeah, Hardy Brothers, the Hardy Edge and Christian. And yeah, that was a really dope Dude. Game. But like growing up in the Attitude Era. Yeah, it has to be 2000. 
WrestleMania yeah. 2000. Probably that that match. How do you feel about the card tonight? Um, as a casual observer, I don't have as much juice. I'm an Attitude Era kid, obviously. Yeah. The, the greatest era, I think, in wrestling history. Oh, hang on. I just can't. I just can't take the Rock seriously when uh, when I saw him in the Tooth Fairy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and no. game plan. No, I agree. Listen, yeah. I'm, I'm an avid, I'm a big fan of uh, Ballers, Atrios Hitzilli's Ballers. Ballers was good. Yeah. Ballers was good. Yeah. It was a horrible television show, or yeah. a bad acting, but yeah. I loved it. I watched all six Every seasons. Sunday. I, had, I was hooked. Yeah. I was hooked line Ricky, sinker. Ricky Jordan, I, Ricky, Washington. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Denzel's Charles kid. Green, the Black Swan. Yeah. Can you not love it? Sure. But um, no, I think the, uh, tonight's card's really Watch exciting. I think tomorrow is going to... I think everyone's really excited for tonight with the Rock. Yeah. yeah. Everyone's missing out is that tomorrow... We're getting three, like, championship uh, matches. Yeah. Which is, like, really cool. Like, yeah. You know, like, yeah, it's really exciting to see The Rock, and The Rock is The Rock. And, like, uh, you know, last time I saw The Rock was in 1998 at King of the Ring. Yeah. But uh, it's going to be exciting. It's going to be sick. It's going to be really cool. But I think I'm honestly more excited for tomorrow's card than yeah. tonight. Who, who's your favorite of all time? Stone Cold. So cold. So cold. I got the I got the outfit for it tomorrow. Wow. Yeah, I got the best. I got no tonight. I'm you can borrow mine, my, dude. I'm with my uh, my brothers. We're doing the NWO. Yeah. We got the wolf pack. We got for the life. light. Yeah, for life. For life. But uh, you don't know that, Matt. For li- that's right. You don't understand that. Yes, of course. But <laughs> no, I'm really looking forward for it. I'm excited for it. Thank yeah. you for asking me to sit down. Yeah, no, you're Who, great. Uh, one more before we get you out of here. What historical figure, dead or alive, would you give a stunner to? Your number one contender. Oh wow, that's a really good question. Damn. Historical figure, dead or alive, to get a stun or two. I'm gonna go with the obvious ones. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with the chalk one. I'll say, yeah, actually, no, I'm Italian. I'm so I'm gonna give it to. Uh, I'm gonna give it to Stalin. 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 Okay. I'm gonna give Stalin. I like that. I'm gonna give Stalin the, yeah. the stunner, and I'm gonna give him the double bird. And oh, they still have the bottom for line. Yeah. You know, yeah. <laughs> the two S's in USSR are both yeah. stunner, aren't they? Like, no, wait, well, that was, I remember it's Russian, but I remember Mussolini, but Stalin could get it, Stalin could get it too. It's the same. <laughs> but, dude, oh, man, man, thank you so much. You just wrap that. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. Thank you, brother. Take care, bro. You're the man, best, dude. Man. Yeah. We got some really big teams. It's got, dying. Don't, don't, dude, it's you're starting so damn It's dying in the parking dude. lot. It took you guys an hour to get ready, so it's look, like. that. Look, I'll tell the <laughs> listeners here. Kyle is one of the sweetest guys I ever met. Unless you're seven minutes late and you don't know where to park. <laughs> then you're working with goddamn, speaking of Mussolini. <laughs> I am. I can't imagine dealing What's with you. What's up, you want to come on? Get the hell on here, Let's dude. Let's go. Come on now, brother. Come to <laughs> Mussolini. <laughs> How you doing? Ah, no, it's an inside joke. <laughs> How are you? Who are you here with? I'm here with my dad. We have to listen to him on the radio. Damn, I got to stop saying who are we here with. Because yeah, true. I, what's your name? My name is Nico. Nico. How are you? Nico. Why can't I hear you, Nico? Uh, what are you doing to us, dude? Yeah, You're working your witchcraft, Nico. What's going on over here? Nico? Talk now. Hello, hello, hello. There you are. Hello, hello. It's this one. It's the wrong oh one. Oh, my yeah. Lord. We got a problem. I broke it in it. There, there you go. There we go. Ba boom. How we know. doing? How the fuck do we get these crossed? That's a good question. <sighs> Damn. All right, anyway, so how Bunch are you? Amateurs. I'm doing amazing. And who we are here with? I'm in here with my dad. And no, no, friends. what's your name? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. 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 Did it again. That's what's your great. Name? Nico. 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 All right. Man. And what do you do for a living? I sell cars. Shit. How's the car, how's the car business right now? You got to sling them. Now, let me ask you this. Is Barbera the best, would you say? Or? No. No, no I don't guess. You wouldn't even guess? No. Okay. I sell Hondas, so, I mean, they can do their thing. I do my thing. It's great. Yeah. We love competition. Are you nice. a pre-owned guy or a brand new guy? Oh, we sell everything. Wow. You so need a car? I know a guy. So, pre-owned. I sell new. <laughs> okay. We're a Honda dealership. Very nice. I got a Honda myself. I got a nice 2012 CRV. That's very good. Gotcha. I, like pi- yeah. I like a Pilot. I do like a Pilot. It's a good, it's a good brand. It's one of the best cars around. Mom had an Odyssey with... The TV and love the, in the not the in rear the entertainment. God, of oh, you balling! I love it. I love it. You got to pay extra for the rear entertainment. Yeah, I know, dude. Back we were in the day, up in the slums. Yeah. We never had. That. They yeah. don't do that anymore. No, no more TVs and cars. N- nope. I saw. I saw. I saw. It, I saw a not TV. Hondas. Correction. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, I saw a TV in a Tesla. Uh, re- no, a Nissan. Maybe yeah. It was a Nissan, and it was in the it was in the passenger side. Now. Um, where, I don't know. Where do cars go from here? Like the next 10 years. More expensive. Oh, great. Now, are you working the lot while you're here right now? You're enjoying yourself. You're cracking a couple beers. PTO, baby. PTO. You're not hitting a couple people with, like, look, if you don't like where you're in. Uh, Not today. I'm here for fun. But, I mean. You're right. I messed up there. It happens. (laughs) You're right. I ain't going to lie. You're right there. 
What well, nothing your buddy starts talking about like his uh, his his Ford F-150. But uh, you really, like? I mean, are you really trying to talk about work when you're not working? True. Well, if you're addicted to the grind, you are, and you're trying to sell and trying to meet that quota and put your kids through college, then you are. Kids. That's that's, that's sad. <laughs> why do you think about? Why do you think we're out here right now? Uh, I don't. You're bored. My kids are in the car right now. <laughs> Good for him. Instead of going to casino, I came out here and did a podcast. <laughs> we're trying to send our whore daughters yeah. through nursing school. Yeah. Hey, bro. <laughs> I mean, they're going to do that regardless. <laughs> <True>. <laughs> <This> <laughs> <is> <laughs> without your money. <laughs> Some loser guy's going to pay for it. I just hope Zach, it's me. <laughs> uh, save yourself a lot by not paying for yeah, it. You might be on to something, dude. I, I know I am. <laughs> you're a guru, man. It you're happens. A guru. So are you going in tonight? No. No? Nope. nope. What I, do you think about tonight? Uh, Don't give me a prediction. Give me a spoiler. I, uh, ooh, wow, man. I know Cody and The Rock and uh, Roman Reigns and Seth Rollins are going against each other. Um, I, I have no juice for this. At all. I have no juice. The Rock, I have no juice for him. I don't. I mean, I'm Attitude Era Rock. The Rock and the Attitude Era, he was amazing. Yeah. He just, he coming in here with the... Did a you lot see of things the, are great 20 years ago. That's true. Did you see the clip where it was, uh, he was coming in? Oh, sorry, I was late because I was watching Jalen Hurts' YouTube. Yeah, no. <laughs> that was a We call yeah, that cheap heat. We call that cheap heat. That was so cool. Yeah, it's I fine. You, I, I, listen, I know you got to sell movies. I know you got to sell. Gotta, you got to sell the product. heel character. But he's, but is he, a, is he a good heel? He's, he's trying to be the best heel of all time right well, now. He's not going to be the best heel of all time. We who is? Who's the best heel of all yeah. time? Yeah, that's a strong uh, statement to say he's not. So I want to know who uh, is. CM Punk was really good. Yeah, he was. He's the best in the world. Especially because I missed the CM Punk era, and for him to kind of <laughs> cross over into my general norm right. is actually pretty impressive. What about what about you? I'm I'm fairly new to the whole wrestling world, but I've been watching a lot of Logan Paul stuff. I mean, what that's what rough. is the what is the opinion of like a like a full fan like Logan, Logan Paul? I've been impressed by him. He had some cornball stuff today. Or In last character, night. yeah, cool. He can wrestle. I'll give you that. Okay. Thousand, like, dude is fucking effing insanely talented. Yeah. yeah. But like, it's Logan Paul. True. It's like, dude, it's Logan Paul. Yeah. yeah. Like. I always Logan wonder Paul. how you get past that. Because, like I said, I'm you, not a not it, a big fan myself. But if you're a big fan, you I don't, don't know how be you a 25 it. to 35 year old male or female. <laughs> okay. do, you, do you think Vince will ever schedule a match Who? in the Suicide Bar? We don't cars? say that. Oh, we don't say that. We don't say Vince. <laughs> Vince. Oh yeah, he got canceled. Fuck. <laughs> Who's this Vince? Uh, I don't even I don't know. know. I don't just know. McMahon? No, no. Question. Never heard of. Him. Okay, fair. Vacant. Who's My bad. All right. So will Triple H ever schedule a match in the Suicide Bar? He Logan might if if Prime sponsors it. Pays enough. Did you see what the ring is has tonight? No. <laughs> Logan Paul has a uh, sponsorship with WWE where they're going to have a prime symbol in the middle of the ring for both nights. Wow. Like oh a God. massive bottle. Like like a massive bottle. Have you drank prime? No. Me I'm neither. a big body armor guy. Body armor? Oh, the, but it gets a little funky with the coagulation. You ever taken a sip Why and you are you, you got to chug that, John, man. It's the greatest thing ever. What you do you mean? body armor? What are you, you doing that you're chugging body armor that much? You got to replenish your electrolytes. I'm just ripping fucking Hondas off the lot? Hell like, yeah, brother. Say, yeah, that's awesome. Hell man. yeah, brother. <laughs> you, I mean, you sell Hondas off of body armor? You Are you uh, uh, Maybe. Body every bottle body comes armor. with a body armor. Nice. Every car. I like that. That's and a free car wash. So you're like the Logan Paul of selling cars. No, I haven't watched anyone filmed him kill himself or anything like that. I'm good, man. I am at least that much better of a person. That's fair. I can That's say that. A fairly yeah. low bar. I can live with I, that. Yeah. It's a bar. Yeah. You know, someone's got to keep climbing it. Yeah. Show me a Honda. Ooh, what yeah. kind of car do you drive? Um, a Jeep Cherokee. Dad, I'm over here. Is that how you do it? Dad. Dad, help. You get your father to dad, sell please. it for you? <laughs> <laughs> your dad owns the Honda dealership and uh, he sells it for you? What kind of car do you have right now? I'm sorry. Uh, Jeep Cherokee. Also, I'm the wife in this scenario, so just kind of... Jeep do both Grand of Cherokee? Uh, just Cherokee. Okay. What Not year? Not the grand part. Uh, 2015. Okay. Are you looking to upgrade? No, I really like it, actually. Okay. So you want me to sell you on something you don't want? Well, that's... I mean, I'm walking up the lot right now. <laughs> that's terrible. Yeah, because I really like my Jeep Cherokee. Okay. Well, I'm the Honey. wife. You can get me. I can't even read, so... You do you have any kids? Yes, we have two beautiful little baby boys. How much space do you have in that Cherokee? Oh, jeez. Not not nearly enough with all their <laughs> baseball bags. And have you ever considered anything with three well, rows? you don't take them to practices. You're never home. You're always drinking. It happens. But, so, Someone's yeah. got to pay the bills. But we need we don't have, we barely have enough room in there. Have you ever considered a car with three rows? Oh, my God. I never even thought they could do that. Oh, I can, we I can change in, your world. In, in Terry's car yeah, last weekend, and we were in the third row. Honey, you know, I, the, I was wine drunk. I can't remember these things. Why don't you say your name? Pagan. Are you serious? Yeah. It's all good. I think it's worse. Clip. 
Papa John. I would call worse. producer clip that. Yeah. <laughs> I think you're going to love a Honda Pilot. You should check it out because, honestly, at the end of the day, it's going to change your world. It's the best bang for your buck. You're, at the end of the day, it's a Honda. They're trusted, right? Everyone knows what Honda is. I all do you like do the is Japanese. All you have to do is change the oil and rotate the tires, and at the end of the day, you're good. Wow. Literally. What's the MSRP on this? Or if you, do you want new or pre-owned? I always like a pre-owned car. Yeah, what's I mean, MSRP mean? I mean, MSRP is going to be different on every pre-owned, but you're probably going to end up somewhere in the mid mid to low 30s to high 40s if you're looking for something with a lot of uh, bells and whistles or not a lot of bells and whistles. But they're all going to have three rows regardless. So at the end of the day, I think you're going to be happy. You do wow. like the extra cup holders on I it. I do love the extra cup holders. How about all I take your information and we go on a bitch. test drive? <laughs> How about I take your information? We go on a test drive, see if you like it or not. Sure. Sounds good? Cool. 100%. Sounds good. Let's go for a ride. Nice. And then that's how you get on the test drive? That's all that happens. That's pretty nice. Like, dude, is that when you guys kind of like you shoot just shit? Be, you know, I mean, a little easier. we already were. I'm not, I'm not trying to sell you a car. I just want to get to know what you want. Ooh. You're the one that's going to pick the car out. I'm just going to show you the right options. Okay. Jeez. It happens. Right. I can sell some advertising for you, too. Where can people get, where can people get you? JL Freed Honda in Montgomeryville, I've heard Pennsylvania. About it. Yes, I've heard about it. I'm, 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 uh, I'm from Montgomeryville. Yep, I uh, live out there as well. Yeah. Sweet. All right. That's me. Nice over. meeting you, man. Nice meeting you, Brother, too. Man, you're the man. Thanks for hanging out. Who should they ask for? Nico. Nico. Yeah, yeah. Nice I should have got the man. <laughs> yep, yep. Said that four times. You're the man. Thanks, yep. dude. Appreciate it. Yep. What's up? Get the hell over here, dude. We've been looking for you all day. No, you haven't. I just want to say everybody have a great night. Have a great WrestleMania. I've got to get moving. Yeah. But I love you guys. We love you more. You don't want to hang with us for a little bit? Your, you want to talk to here? Macho Man? Macho Man, put go. the put the headphones on. I'm gonna go. I, All right. I, I know they might. Uh, Macho Man's stuck in the safe, 70s. Everyone. Cheers, brother. Macho Man. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. <laughs> How are you, brother? To handle to go to home. <laughs> How you feeling? Who are we here with? Randy Savage. Ba boom. How we doing? How's how's uh, how we feeling about WrestleMania? Feeling good. Yeah. Yeah. Me and the Hulk Mania. We're on good terms right now. Nice. Yeah. We're in one of those periods. Okay. Yeah. Miss Elizabeth here? She stayed home this time. So who's the lady behind the camera recording you right now? So Miss Jeanette. <laughs> Ooh, scandals. Yeah. 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 I like that, dude. You seem like you're you're fully you're feeling good right now, aren't you? Were you drinking earlier today? What's the what's the vibe like? About the day, you know. Yeah. Some activities. Okay. Yeah. 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 You can't stop your heart at 55 if you don't try, you know. <laughs> That's true. Like you can't run into a tree if you don't try, you know. <laughs> exactly. Someone's yeah. got to drive home. Now listen, <laughs> is this your first WrestleMania you've been here before? It is, no. Oh my god, so you're on top of the well, world. Well, other than those other ones, you know. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah of course. Right, yeah. The prior ones, yeah. yeah. That's fair. Mm -hmm. Nice. So what's the vibe like these days? What's going on? I don't know. Yeah. I've been gone for so long. It's coming yeah. back. Yeah. Try and take over. So Macho Man's dead in real life. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Well, assalamu alaikum and in salah, brother. Uh, Sorry, I thought we were on the same page. <laughs> no, no, this guy doesn't know jack shit. He only dresses up like Stone Cold. I'm a fair weather. Yeah. Fair, yeah. Okay. fair skin weather. What's your favorite WrestleMania memory? Hopefully the one after this moment. <laughs> you gonna leave us? Is it poetic answer like yeah. that, dude? What happens after this moment? You're gonna think about us for the rest of the night. Dude. Yeah, it's gonna be whatever happens inside that arena. Yeah. yeah. Where's the seats at? You got like a nosebleed? Are you like close by? What's what, where are you at? I don't know the field well enough. Okay. Yeah. Where are you coming from? Harleysville. Hmm. You never been down to the lake before? Yeah, but only so so often. You know, you got things to do. Yeah. People to snap and slip. He's got Slim Jims in the wrist. I didn't even notice that. <laughs> you got to snap into one of those at some point, dude. You think they'll let you in with those bad boys? Well, that's why they're in the wrist. <laughs> <laughs> Stay slimmed up, brother. <laughs> Macho Man Randy Savage. Thank you, dude. Sneaking <laughs> Slim Jims into the link. The man himself. Best security. Oh, my God. I hope he... I hope they tackle him. Holy shit. Look at that belt. Yeah, you know, I've been champion since, uh, since birth. Wow. Really? Yeah, it took me a while. I had to go through him. You were the fastest swimmer, I guess, technically, so you were a champ. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, the Michael, Michael Phelps had nothing on, on me swimming either. <laughs> Hopefully you're not smoking marijuana weed like he is, that sinner. Uh, no, no, I don't good. do that. No devil's lettuce over here. Good, good, good. So how are you feeling today? I mean, big uh, big Saturday WrestleMania. It's going to be a good one. Uh, I went to WrestleMania 35. 
you want to come on? Experience this is a, it's a good one to see in the city. Yeah, man. And the belt. The belt is goddamn gorgeous. Where yeah, did that movie from? Yeah, tomorrow I'm going to be Roman Reigns. Today I'm just chilling. Okay. Today I'm just relaxing, but tomorrow I will be Roman Reigns. So what's the pacing look like for a full weekend of WrestleMania? Is it like go hard one day, chill out the see, next? See, I, I was at the original where it was like 10 hours, and oh my God, it's a grueler. So yeah. you gotta, but now it's, it's, it's easier now. Why do you, you say that? Because you got the two days that you can break it up a little Fair. bit. So it's it used like to be 10 hours long? Basically, yeah, with the free show, it's been like 10 hours. Holy oh, shit. Oh, wait, they so. squeezed the whole weekend into yeah, one day for 10 yeah, hours. So oh, my God. Saturday yeah. was the, the NXT and the rest of us. Yeah. Um, Holy shit. What match are you most excited for? Roman uh, Cody. It's the main event. You talking about tomorrow's? Yeah, tomorrow yeah. is the best. It's yeah. going to be the best. That's what we see. Yeah, best here, main yeah. event of all time. Who do you think wins? I would want Roman to win. Really? Is, I tri- think is, that, is, is he the tribal chief or yes. is Rock the tribal yeah, chief? Yeah, he's the tribal chief. Got it. He should win, but, you know, I ride the Cody Crybabies. They want Yeah, they so want. you acknowledge him. Oh, I acknowledge my tribal chief. Oh, yeah. He's a Cody Crybaby. Oh, that, that's... Yeah. See, we'll just end on that. Yeah. If one's up, you Yeah. Know, <laughs> and if he doesn't win, I'm, I might riot. I don't know. Oh, my God. I'm sure. sorry I've disturbed you so much. Yeah, I didn't wait, wait. Sick. Before I leave, though, how do you feel about the uh, city connectors? Oh, they fucking suck. The okay, worst thing I've ever seen. Actually, let's end on that one. Yeah. <laughs> but let's go Phils. They fucking suck. Yeah, let's go Phils. Let's, yeah, go. let's go Phils. Hey, if they, if they win 12 games on Friday. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Love them. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. What's thank up, you, Gold Dust? Yeah, man. Thanks so much for sitting down. dude. Yeah, man. Thank you. What's up? Now we're talking, baby. Is this Mrs. Doubtfire? Lane's up Catholic highest solution, right? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, that's Cody or Roman? Cody. Yeah, it's your, it's your, it's your son. Your it's brother, it's your, right? oh, your brother. Sorry, your brother. Your brother. Thank you, Goldust. My man. There it is. Who's <laughs> this? This is doubtful. I don't know, dude. <laughs> I got a level with you. Somebody from the outside. This shit's gay. No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like I like it, dude. I like it. I, it is cool. I like that everybody's very involved and everybody's cool. As I hell. do. I do like. I do think people should be able to do what they do. <laughs> yes. Yeah. But man, like no. what you like. But after after 15 years old and <laughs> you took your mom's robe, like I, I tell you what, you hit me up and you're like, Matt, do a little research, learn a little bit about wrestling. And I spent legitimately the entire night two days ago. <laughs> you did go- it. I swear to God, dude, I was going through books for life. For life. Ba boom. <laughs> Have fun, brother. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. For life. <laughs> now, what you know about that, girls? Yo, subscribe to For Monster life. Factory on YouTube. Monster Factory. Monster Factory. Monster Factory. For you life. Follow. Yeah. For life. For life. Dude. For life. My guy. Dude, I love NWO. The NW Beach of the Bash. That changed my fucking life. Like a lot of people, like obviously, you know, you see Stacy Keebler, you see Tori Wilson. That'll change your life. Yeah. But the NWO, Scott Hall. Uh, Hogan joining, of course, and uh, Kevin Nash was. So were you like, were you a big fan growing huge. up? This was kind of like a bit. Were you really huge? Now? Yeah. Used to have uh, a bunch of the neighborhood come over and we watch pay reviews because my dad illegally uh, hacked the Directv. Re- yeah. But even back in like the early two thousands. Back huh? in the early two thousands, yeah, yeah. We got Directv one day. Where one day Directv showed up. Wow. And my it was like I I didn't know until about two years ago it was all illegal. <laughs> dad <laughs> had illegal Directv. Is your dad a tech guy? Is he <laughs> no, good with that not stuff at all. Now? No, he just always had like a blue collar job and new blue collar. Feds, wow! Uh, federal. Uh, That's so sick, dude. Yeah. Imagine your ja- your dad gets put away for pirating uh, yeah. wrestling stuff. That'd yeah. Be How gay is that? Yeah, it's up there. It's yeah. top top eleven or twelve. Like, oh, for dude, sure. your dad did the bid. Yeah. Yeah, he got a thousand channels instead of eight. <laughs> but I think like if he does go to prison, people will respect him for that. If he can get a little direct TV inside of the cells, I think they'd be like, all right, this well, guy's cool with us. That would be like us. us going to jail for. Remember we used to download LimeWire and stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and people were going to jail for that. Mm-hmm. What's up, fellas? You guys want to take a seat? Take hang a out seat. for a little bit. Get over you here, bro. Want to eat around? Good man. Hi, yeah, yeah. What's, What's up, up, brother? How are you doing, you, dude? How's everything going? Yes, man. You just throw these headphones on. Put the headphone up. Yes, sir. Who, who are we here with? My name is Namras from Singapore. Whoa! Wow! Yeah, all no the way, man. Way. You're afraid you're from yeah. Singapore? Thirty hours, man. Dude. Wow. Yeah. No kid. Are you here for like both nights? Everything SmackDown, both nights, Raw. And Raw on Monday, right? Yeah, so SmackDown was yesterday. My first Damn. show, first WWE show yesterday. Wow. Yeah, man. Oh, oh my God. shit. Yeah. So Dude, when did you get like, in? Sorry. Oh, sorry? Yeah, you, oh. go, you go, Stone Cold. I was just totally <laughs> curious. I mean, what time did you get in and when do you leave? Like, I, this is crazy. I arrived right? yesterday 4 p.m. No, sorry, Thursday 4 p.m. Yeah, okay. So, so it was about 30 hours journey. Yeah. Transited Heathrow. 
<laughs> yeah. So the 14 hours to Heathrow, three hours there, seven hours here. Yeah. And then uh, Thursday, hit the mega store straight away at night, which was great because it was empty, right? Yeah. Empty around 11 p.m. First time in Philadelphia? First time in the country, man. And, yeah. you, and you decided to come to WrestleMania in Philadelphia. Yeah, man. Honestly, I feel like could I have picked a better time? Because when I decided to come here, yeah. I decided to research about Philly a bit. I've been enjoying the city, man. The food is great. I did a lot of touristy stuff. Cool. Went to Rocky Steps, Reading yeah. Market. What do you think? Oh, amazing, man. I think could have picked a better first city to come really? in the United States. Wow. Yeah. No dude, kidding. They should, yeah, the, they should put that on the billboard. Yeah, you're, like, you're going to be in a commercial soon, dude. They need oh, it no, for no. a tourist attraction. Dude, visit Philly. Me up, Philly. It's Philly. 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 Um, that's crazy. Dude, so 30 fucking hours. Insane. But I, I believe that like, Singapore, I'm from Singapore, right? I believe Australians have it worse, man. They yeah. they are seven hours away from Singapore, man. So they got to do more. Who cares about them? They were talking about you right now. <laughs> yeah, forget them, dude. We had an Australian come by earlier. He just grabbed mm. our I don't even think that was a real in. accent. True, I think it was just like kind of a strong kind yeah. of South Philly accent. Serious? Yeah. Oh, are you, are you locals as well? Yeah. yeah, we live right around here. We took the oh. long, you took you took 30 hours to get here. It took me about 24. Yeah, it took you 30 hours to fucking yeah. park and get on the table. <laughs> Just about five minutes difference. Huh? Yeah, yeah, it's not too great. <laughs> spin it, man. Spin it. Dude, better be a good spin. He came 30, 30 hours to see that spin. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Solid, What's up, man. Oh, yeah, baby. Yes, sir. Dude, yes, so sir. Why, um, so WrestleMania and WWE stretches all the way over there? Uh, they used to come to Singapore every two years for like a house show. But then uh, the last was 2019. Yeah. Then co pandemic happened. Yeah, so I don't know when they, when are they going to start yeah. it up again. Yeah. Who's your so, favorite? Yeah. All time. I mean, I'm 23 this year, so I grew up with Cena and Orton. Yeah, yeah, you were But the then time. I followed Cody the moment he left WWE. Not, I didn't pay much attention to him before yeah. he left. I only started paying attention when he hit the Indies. Followed through AEW and then here. So it's like, I followed the journey, that's why I'm very invested in him. Yeah. But to be honest, as a Cody fan, I can't see if Roman wins. I can understand why if he wins uh, or so. Fuck that. So yeah, man. Well, I guess I did, acknowledge, I did acknowledge the Tribal Chief, so I will say that. But I, I do like Cody. People think I look like Cody. They shout, they always shout yeah. Cody Rhodes at me because they have a square-ass head like Cody Rhodes. <laughs> um, so I guess I kind of have a, a soft spot for Cody. Uh, I just want Reigns to drop the belt. He's been having the belt for so long. That's true, man, but I feel there's so much more to be told within the bloodline. I feel they can do much more every week, but they yeah. tend to hold it off a bit. But I never know, man. Who stinks on the mic more, the Rock or Roman Reigns? I feel Rock, Roman has been way overshadowed behind Rock, man. Yeah. Rock has just been killing it. And Rock hasn't yeah. been that great, I don't think. My personal opinion. I feel like he has been showing up to work, man. He really, really. He, he, really has yeah. been, he has been showing up to work, which is like something I know that you guys gripe about a lot, that he just kind of comes in, does WrestleMania, and then leaves and does, do, does another billion-dollar movie. True, and I feel the way Rock is operating right now, the way he's doing stuff, it's like foreshadowing how WWE is going to operate in the next few years with Netflix and how they're going to yeah. more vulgarities, more blood, and the way like the, the leashes are off. I don't know, man. Is Netflix is them being on Netflix better for you out in Singapore now? Uh, in Singapore, so Raw and SmackDown starts about 8 a.m. Singapore time. So I need to watch it in the holidays live, yeah. or let's say after work, I come back at 6, 7 p.m. Cool. Then after I watch it, the highlights and all. So yeah, Netflix should be good. More on streaming as well, can yeah. replay it. So, yeah, man. Nice one. Kid, man. 30 yeah. hours to get here. That's got to be, you're, you're definitely the most traveled guy that's ever been to a WrestleMania. You yeah, have to be. Fair for, enough, man. Except for the fake Australian. <laughs> yeah, but we don't acknowledge him, man. That guy sucks. Me I don't acknowledge him. No I acknowledge my travel chief. That's my man from Singapore. Yes, sir, dude. Thank you, man. My Brother. Man. Yeah. Dude, welcome. Yeah, man. Thank you, man. I have hope fun. you have some more time to go sports. I would say the locals right. here have been fantastic, man. You see, I ask them a question, they answer me directly, and then they don't want to talk. And then the other half of the point is they'll answer my question and give me so much more value than I could ever ask for. Man. Uh, yeah. So, thank you, Philadelphia, man. Do yeah. wow, you have any man. questions for us? No. Oh, I would like to ask this question, man. So when I when I did my research, I realized the most controversial topic ever. Cheese sticks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But I'm not able to try yet. Where'd you go? You didn't go yet? I haven't go yet. Alright. So where should I go? Okay, I believe men who works knows best where to eat. Yes. So. Yeah. Uh, Blue collar guys like us. <laughs> You look, nobody's gonna like this answer. You mm. might have to cross the bridge. You go to Donkeys in Camden. Donkeys, yeah. that, that way, is it? It's uh, right over it's that right way. Right over that bridge right but there. But you have to go to another state to do it. So just go to Angelo's yeah. in South Philadelphia. What about Geno's? See, I don't cheesesteak shame. 
I'm not one of those people that think you can't go to Geno's and pass. Go to wherever the fuck you want. It does the same exact thing. It clogs all our arteries. It makes us it makes us happy. Yeah. Mm. All that being so, said, Geno's and Pats are pretty bad. But but yeah, they're the tourist traps yeah. and stuff. But if you want to go to one that people will actually really enjoy and, and like if someone from Philadelphia, you want them to like respect your cheesesteak choice, I go to Angel's. I think it's got the best bread. It's got Cooper Sharp cheese. It's a little different than like your 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 normal cheesesteak. I mm. think you I think you'd enjoy it. Angel's cash only though. Cash only. Yeah. Cash only. Yeah, we've always been caught. I need to spend some cash, man. It's okay. time. <laughs> we got a couple strip clubs we can recommend, yeah. too, if you're yeah, spending some cash. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, My cheer, parents might be watching. Right down there. <laughs> we got actually just horsing around. Yeah. Yeah. Parents are singing for yeah. yeah. All right, man. I'm right, looking yeah, forward. First mania, first yeah. time in the country. Yeah. First ever appearance on a podcast. I love oh. first today. Incredible, dude. Dude, Captain, he, he traveled 30 hours. Thank you so much for coming on, dude. Thank you so much, 30 hours from Singapore to get here. Have a good night, man. You can watch the pace. Oh, shut up, Captain. See you, buddy. All right, man. Have Thanks a good night, everything. dude. Good. You want to come on? Yeah, absolutely. You ever met the captain? Not a day in my life. Philly captain. What's going on? Would you look at this? Oh, How you doing, brother? How am I doing? It's WrestleMania Sunday. Or Saturday. Saturday. That's it's right. It's two days. It's too long. Yeah. It's too long. We just talked to a guy who just said 10 hours on one yeah, day. Yeah, we heard That's the exact opposite. Uh, this is my fourth day of professional wrestling. All right. Well, I'm a professional wrestling manager. I'm in the industry. I'm not bragging. I went 0-2. This week, um, <laughs> pretty good fucking manager. And then, oh! and then uh, I lost. Uh, yesterday I was at WWE World, and I went to the Hall of Fame. Yeah, how was Paul Heyman's speech? I heard it was Paul amazing. Paul Heyman's speech. Anytime a speech, uh, we, we could be a, a yeah, adult here. Anytime a, in a speech where the guy goes, and you could suck my dick. Yeah, it's a pretty special. Yeah, I think speech. it was suck yeah. my fucking dick. It was. It was, yeah. it was very beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Um, thanks for thanks for censoring that one, Cap. I, I don't like uh, the dick part's good. I don't want to say fucking. <laughs> What's the purpose of these cans? They don't even... It's okay. It's not um, so what are we doing? What's this podcast? What's this, this is point? called Men at Work. We yeah. just go uh, we just go places. We've been at uh, opening day for since Ben Carson. I've seen you. You've been traveling. Yeah, we went down to the lately. casino for Atlantic City. We went out to uh, South Jersey. I saw you doing the New Jersey's. And Patty's uh, bar crawl. Yeah, yeah. In New Jersey. Yeah, yeah. What do you think that? of the New Jersey? You're a big Phil's fan. Huh? Yeah. You're a big Phil's fan. Uh, it's nice. Go back. You like them. We, it's all right. We always have differing opinions, me and you. I'm a middle-aged man. It's not geared for me. Yeah. Yes, that's I true. Get it. it's true. I, I do think they, you know, the, the Trey Turner number seven oh, looking like a question, question mark. mark. <laughs> uh, pretty, pretty horrible. Yeah. Did uh, you like it's Mariners teal at top, on the I'm top? I'm colorblind, so okay. no color represents anything to me. Okay. I'm colorblind. You don't see color. I'm, I'm, I see no color. I just Good. I see the wrong color. Yeah. Uh, are <laughs> you are you going in the mania? <laughs> Yeah, you're not, you're not a wrestler. No, 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 I was an attitude error guy, but I kind of stopped when I was eighth grade. You're so going to stay out here and watch the fireworks? I might. Yeah. Do you like fireworks being colorblind? Um, they're all white. <laughs> So it's kind of it's kind of like so like Christ- so Christmas time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, listen, I gotta go in the main. All right, yeah, all right, right the all Rock's right. wrestling. Last time I saw him wrestle was 25 years ago at WrestleMania 15. That was when uh, the big boss man got hung by Undertaker, right? He sure did. Dude, that's I saw insane. a man get murdered. Dude, I would literally crap my shorts if I was like that. If I was that kid, like that kid was, watching it that. was the thing. What, no, Dude, he was really hung from the cell. Ever happened to the big boss man was SummerSlam '92 or '93. He had a match against the Mountie, and the winner had to spend the night in prison. And at the end of the pay per view, the Mountie lost, so he goes to prison. And it ends with a man putting his hands on top of the Mountie, and I think they were going to say the Mountie got ass raped in prison. <laughs> That's the best story I've seen in the history of wrestling. Mountie was ass raped. Dude, the fact that Sergeant Slaughter can steal the Big Show's dad at his funeral in the casket was, is not even the top story. It's it's, it's the Mountie it's getting the Mountie, ass, ass Mount, Mountie ass raped. Right, Joe? You like the Mountie getting ass raped? <laughs> Yes, of course. Yeah, see, of course. Anytime a, a Canadian Osher can get an ass right. Of course. Me, me that, guy guy's, uh, that guy's bowing to you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. He's big bow to you. All right, listen, let, hey, me, uh, let me get out of here. Yes, I've got to go drink some beers with Stone Cold. Yeah. He's right here. I'm right here, dude. Look no further. I thought you were Nicholas Cage in Raising Arizona. <laughs> I look like you a ever cancer see that? patient, dude. Yeah, you ever no. see that? It's a good movie. That's tough. Best right. chase scene in the history of movies. Wait, 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 wait. There's 10 Fast and the Furious, and that's the best. Chase scene of all time. It's the most realistic. He's like old enough to remember National Treasure. Yeah, that's a great one. You ever National see that? Treasure? They steal Garbage. the damn. Remember that chase scene? Yeah. I don't watch yeah. movies. That's a great <laughs> chase scene. Oh, I watch, watch, watch Raising used, Arizona. After that, I stopped. He used the declaration right. as bulletproof. Go they ahead. call this a mic drop. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Take the headphones off, dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> 
I can't believe a guy from 30 hours away coming all the way to Philadelphia mm. to for a WrestleMania event. I, I didn't know the reaches of this uh, this whole damn global program. Brand. It's unbelievable, man. It's a global brand. I'm learning more. That's why I was excited to kind of come in a little fresh and learn what the damn landscape's like. Mm -hmm. What do you think so far? Uh, let's look. Obviously, and I think this is the thing that's understood now that I'm learning. Everybody knows, like, yeah, this is kind of dumb and nerdy, but we it's like it. It's real to me, damn it. It's real to me. It's real to me, damn it. We got to superimpose that in the video. That guy's the man. And that was like an amateur wrestling thing he was at, too. <laughs> was it like a church? Was it really? Oh, no, nah, it's probably more of a high school high school gym. What's the difference to me? I mean, that's unbelievable. Dude, those are the real wrestlers. Those are the guys that shed blood, sweat, and tears for like $30 a night. Yeah. So what goes on WrestleMania? Is it just like it's a bunch of championships and then a bunch of dudes? Think of the Super Bowl. Yeah. And then just make it guys in tights. Sure. Mm -hmm. So the Super Bowl. Yeah. That's crazy, man. I, 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 my one big thing that I did laser in on, I guess, is just the easiest thing to say. The Logan Paul stuff makes no sense to me. Why not? How he's in it and how it's not, how can it can be accepted because he's such an obvious, unique figure himself, like how it doesn't take you out of every match. Like, does he go by Logan Paul in there? I yeah. Mean, yeah. He goes, so you're saying, like, you, you wouldn't be able to separate, like, YouTube Logan Paul from wrestler Logan Paul, and it would bother you. Like, I, think you're fair. That's a, I think it's a fair assessment, if that's what you're thinking. Yeah, it's kind of like if you watch uh, Daniel Radcliffe in another movie, and you're like, oh, Harry Potter's in this movie. Yeah. You know, that kind of thing. He's typecast. He's typecast. He is. I mean, it's not, but it's such a unique, I mean, wrestling itself, he's not an actor. It's a, such a unique side thing. That yeah, and I hate shitting on it, but that's the same way why I can't get hyped about Rock, because I, once again, I see Rock in... You know, Tooth Fairy, Game Plan, yeah, um, other billion dollar franchises and everything. It's like this guy's, you know, he's working like three times a year. Yeah, he's <laughs> it's like millions and millions of dollars. It's fucking insane. Well, Batista too. I mean, these guys and people don't love it. People do not love it that they get an acting. Yeah, they think they're sellouts. Really? Oh, fuck yeah. Pe Cena got into acting. They yeah. hated that. Triple H got into acting for a little bit. Kane, remember Kane got into acting? Yeah, he's yeah, in yeah. A horror movie. Yeah, I actually saw that movie. It's a pretty good movie. Uh, but The Rock and Cena are probably the biggest crossover stars. I know I'm missing one. If someone catches it, they're going to yell at me. Yeah. Hulk obviously was one, um, but he was in more of the Rocky movies and stuff. Hulk and was also like reality he was on TV. TV. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude, Hogan's Knows Best was awesome. <laughs> that like was the greatest one or two show seasons. of all time. Truly, all the stuff with his daughter, who I was deeply in love with. Brooke Hogan, if you're watching this, good God. Yeah. And my girlfriend, if you're also watching this, sorry about that one. <laughs> but, yeah, that's a cr that was the, the best show, dude. Yeah. What the hell is he up to? Is the Hulk still alive? Yeah, Hulk's still alive. Oh, you know, I just saw him bailing out his kid uh, from a DUI yep. not too long yep. ago, so he's getting the job done. Yeah, Nick's still alive. Yeah, man. Rook is still alive. Somehow. Yeah. Guys, you want to come sit and hang out for a second? What's up, buddy? A little interview? Want to sit down for a sec? We won't hold you up too long. Dude, Kane and Kane and Taker. Come on, Kane and Taker. Quick interview, baby. Dude. Oh, wait, no, that's not uh, – you're not Kane. <laughs> you're the Maui guy, right? You're. Are you Roman Reigns? <laughs> I thought you are Kane. <laughs> I think that's Otto from Rocket Power, dude. Dude, Kane, come here, Kane. Are you the are you the guy from the Rock movie, like uh, the guy the the cartoon one? Two minutes, dude. Two minutes. Ah, that kid just up. sucking into me. <laughs> that kid can't even drink milk on his own. He just fucking sucked it. Holy macaroni! I don't like that one single bit. I think that's What's a up, taker. Hey, crime, dude. What's up, man? How you doing? Look, dude, who you're it is. you're you're Maui from. Uh, <laughs> Please, can you throw these on for me? Dude, I me? thought you were Kane and I thought you were Maui, but who are you? I'm the tribal chief, uh, Roman Games. You, you are who? <laughs> You're Roman Reigns. I'm, I was, yes, that's what I was going for. I'm sorry. <laughs> Taker, how are you? Yeah, I'm good, man. I, I had this guy <laughs> pegged right away. Just, I was like, my buddy just said Roman Gaines. <laughs> I don't think it's going to fit over the hat. All right. <laughs> 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 you know, we're dealing with a couple of Mensa candidates here, huh? huh? <laughs> Aren't we? A couple, uh, couple 1600 on the SATs right here. Uh, <laughs> Jeez, I got, eight, I got 820. It got insulted. me into Millersville. Don't worry about it. <laughs> God bless America. Love How about that? Sack. I it love is, the fucking beast. How are you doing, fellas? I'm doing good. Better than you guys on freaking Tuesday, man. I got the rain out with the hot dogs. I, I know. Ten. We're, I'm a crossing broad reader every day. Appreciate it, bro. Every single day. Thank you so much. No, we're, we're going to reschedule it to next Tuesday the 16th. I saw that. So I'd love to see if you come out. If you come out, I'd love it. Um, you guys getting into tonight? No, we're not going in. Well, let's be outside. Uh, yeah. Tomorrow? Neither, nah, neither night? Not. Yeah. We're not wrestler guys. We just kind of wanted to, like, kind of look at the scene. Yeah, we're here to learn. Wow. We like the scene. Yeah, but are you going to do this tomorrow? Are you going to hang nah, out here tomorrow? No, we won't tomorrow? do this. I might go around with a microphone and do some stuff. But I like the scene. The scene's cool. You guys yeah. are <laughs> You guys, I'm not one of these guys, bro. I'm in disguise. <laughs> what are you, dude? Nobody can pin you out. why it's so bad. <laughs> we can't pin you, bro. Wait, so are you just not a wrestling? No, hell no. <laughs> WrestleMania came to Philly, bro. You got to show up. 
<laughs> so it's like, yeah, I did the same thing. I look like a goddamn cancer patient. You just walk in with your, with I've, your been clothes I've been telling people it's like a Broadway show, a concert, a sporting event, and a, and the Fourth of July all in one. Right? You can't be like people are like, oh wow, that's cool. Yeah, it is. This yeah, guy just he, has to dress to, up. he told us this all the way down here for the last two hours about that comment. He definitely did. I had to tell my girlfriend that to allow me to go. Oh, so really, did you walk out of the house? Bit, yeah. Did you walk out of the house with a wig? Hell no. I mean, in in the Amazon package I bought it in, yes, I did. So she finds a wig in your trunk. What's she thinking? No, What's she knows it, she okay. knows it came. Got she it, knows got it, got it came. Got I got her one for tomorrow. Really? Role playing, yeah, she's huh? got, okay. Well, maybe a little yeah, some, nice, little nice. some, some. Nice, 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 nice. What are you guys most excited for? The entertainment, obviously. I mean, all the intros are going to be excellent no matter how you look at it. And, you know, every time... That passes by tonight, it's gonna be good. Richie, that, was, that was a cute answer. No, no but there's only one thing to be excited for. <laughs> that's the tribal chief coming out. Oh, that's because you're wearing and the a costume. And, the, and yeah. the final boss. Yeah, that's it. Dude, that's what we're excited he's for. He's a Cody Crybaby. Oh, well, I mean, I don't either way. Hey, uh, see? That's, dude, you're trying to separate hey, us. I tried to act like I know what was going on. I don't really know what's going on. <laughs> dude, he has no jack shit. This is the best $40 I ever spent. Maybe, yeah, the, wor- maybe the worst $40 I ever spent on Amazon as well. What's the, the chain? Where'd you get that from? Just, I don't know. He wears it out, man. Okay, gotcha. Mm-hmm. Might be. Is that garlic? <laughs> <laughs> it might be. Here, Kyle. Are you boarding we, off we, vampires? Kyle, I have some. <laughs> no, it's not garlic. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I just saw that he wore it and I bought it. It looks sick. It was it was. 19.99 on Etsy. I thought that would be a good, you know, accompaniment to my outfit. That no one knows what it is, anyhow. So it didn't really work. Dude, it literally looked like the guy from the Rock movie, the cartoon movie, like the one that was riding on the surfboard and singing all the time. <laughs> oh, Moana? 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 Yeah, you look like the Moana character. Hey, he only wish he was. Let's be honest. All about I can that. say is that you're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I do. I do appreciate it. I do appreciate it. That's incredible. That's from, that's from Moana. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that's what he said. <laughs> You're welcome. He's hitting you with quotes. You're not even ready for it, dude. This guy's too damn quick. Jeez, man. We're going in. My guy, have fun. All right, we got to walk in there. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, thank you, guys. Thank you, man. Have fun. Thank dude. you. Will do. Oh! Dude, that looks like a, a one that's been around. No, no, listen, I know you guys are doing the interview. No, no, you got it. I know you guys are doing your thing. You guys are great out here in the cold weather in Philadelphia. You're doing your podcast. It looks great. But do you know who I am? No. I'm going to tell you who I am. I'm the YouTube champion. Tantalize and Tony, the one and only undisputed YouTube champion. Now, some people might have bigger numbers than me, like in the millions. They buy their subscribers. They're liars. They're cheats. They're stealers. They're like... Do the camera right there. We have a camera right there. Oh, so, right there. oh so sorry. This promo there. Yeah. I'd like to talk to you guys because oh, you, you. you guys are very handsome. Awesome. But oh. let me tell you guys this. My name is Tan Lawson Tony. I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers by WrestleMania Sunday. I need 300 and change. So I ask you all, watching this, you're listening to this, whatever you're doing, this is my QR code. I don't know if you can do this right now. Screenshot it, take a picture, take a view. I don't know what you got to do. What do you got to do? Get me there. You know, we got the YouTube champion tantalizing. This is coming out till Wednesday, but okay, I well, hope you get it. Well, yeah, man. You know, well, you know what? This is what you, you take a card, right? Oh, yeah, sure. And you take a card. And what's the name of your channel? What's the name of your show? Men at Work. <laughs> Men at Work. You guys are working hard out here. We are. Blue collar guys. All right. So what you guys do? asking the questions, right? Ask me a question. Let's go. What do you do for work? I'm a bus driver in Delaware, but really my life's work is to be, do this and be what you guys are doing out Fuck here in the cold. Yeah. But here's the thing, guys. Well, hold on. What's your YouTube channel about? You keep talking about the channel. We well, don't know what you got going on. Well, here's the thing, bro. Because no. you are tantalized. You ready for this? I'm a former professional wrestler. Um, I'm 55 years old. Oh, oh you look, you're looking you're crack. Don't crack. Black don't crack. Don't crack. You know it. Not crack. And this you is the thing. I do this. This is a true story. My channel is the only African American father daughter wrestling podcast in on the planet. That's Us my. Too. That's my. You guys are black. You guys look great. <laughs> but, but seriously, this is my dream to do this. I do it with my daughter, and we're trying to get to the big numbers one day. But ten thousand is our number for WrestleMania. We we can do it. You know. I think so, man. So yeah. it's all about wrestling. We cover everything, and I've been to all forty WrestleManias. It's not a lie. Not a lie. It's not. I'm fifty five. I'm from New York. I started when I was 15 years old. My uncle used to take me. Now people say, well, well let's prove it. There's a couple of ticket stubs I don't have because I was a kid. Of course. But I've been to all 40. It's a, Well, as of today. So the streak's still here. I'm better than The Undertaker. Well, well let's not, let's not count our chains for their hatch. You got, you, got a, you, got a, you got a major roadway you got to cross. Yeah, there yeah. could be an not arrow. Listen, bro. Yeah. Nothing's happened to the tantalizer. I want me to tantalize Philly, okay? And, you know, before I leave, I want to thank you guys for having me. Yeah. I just bogarted your show. I'm no, crazy. No, it's fine. I love you this know, shit. I'm good. Marketing. And just so you know, 
Anybody that comes here today will not be as good as me. They won't be. They won't have the pizzazz. They won't have the shit as they quoi. They won't have the, 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 they won't have the gravitas that I have. I'm the YouTube champion, Tantalizing Tony. I didn't curse once. You notice how they come here, people here dropping the F-bombs around the kids. I'm a family channel. I love my daughter. I love you guys, too. We're I brothers now. So listen, guys. Listen. You listen to these guys. You watch it. What's the name of your cup podcast? What is it? Men at Work. Men at Work. That's... And that was a good that was a good band back in the day. He's a you know, Minute Work was a band. We'll check it out. You guys yeah, are too young. Home. Look, you guys watch them, subscribe, do their whole deal. They're doing the real thing out here. But listen, I'm Tim Liza Tony, your YouTube champion. Have a great WrestleMania. You saw it already. But do I do best and um that's stay tantalizing and of course stay champion, because that's what I do, and I'm out of here. Uh -huh. And and the rock is not the final boss. I'm the only boss. Thank you, gentlemen. God uh, bless. Tantalizing Tony, <laughs> please. Tantalize, too like, nice. subscribe, get the 10 go to his channel, get, get in that 10K. Are, yeah, come on now. The guy said I could hop in. Dude, hop on in. Yeah, man. Take a seat, you dude. Put on these? Yeah. You just can't be a Yankees fan. Oh. Let's get it. I think we're the. Uh, I think you are the youngest guest to ever appear on this oh. podcast. Yes, my oh. God. How's that make you feel? Good. Yeah. What are you most looking forward to tonight? Um, I want to see um, The Rock lose against um, Cody. So you're, you're a Cody crybaby? No. Yeah, you are. <laughs> you're a Cody crybaby. I acknowledge the tribal chief. Well, not me. Yeah, because you're a Cody crybaby. Because Roman's going to lose. No, he's not. He's gonna lose tomorrow. Spoken like a true Cody cry. That's you. That's this is you. This is you. This right is, who you. You. That's this is your corner right here. I'm right there with you, dude. Nope. The nope. Rock can go and, kick rocks. And, and and when Roman kicks the crap out of Cody and the Cody Crybabies, wait, will wait, you wait. be wiping those tears away? Because you are a Cody Crybaby. What if the Rock takes the referee shirt and says, one, two? It doesn't matter if the Rock says three. <laughs> Ooh, that would be actually That's really pretty nice, dude. Uh, really, yeah, that's that, pretty good. That, all right, all right. I like it. That'd like be a it, twist dude. in the old game plan. Do you think he would? What, you, do you think he would? He would be a traitor to, to Roman, he might. the tribal chief. Is it the high chief or the tribal chief who's the leader of the bloodline? That's true. People are asking. Who do you think the leader of the bloodline is? I think it's the high chief. And this wouldn't. And you might be too young for this, but this wouldn't be the first time that The Rock has has turned on his people. Mark Henry back in the day, there was a couple other guys back in the day. So this would be, th I, you're onto something here. The Rock mm -hmm. might be turning on to, uh, turning on Roman Reigns. It's, it could be in the cards. But until that happens, you're still a Cody crybaby, and Cody is going to be crying, not only Saturday, but Sunday too. Get off my program. <laughs> Get off my program. <laughs> Have fun, bud. No Cody Crybabies allowed in this program. <laughs> how we uh, how we doing? How's the ticket market right now? Do you want to come on the podcast and yeah, we'll and we'll, and we'll hawk we'll hawk tickets for you? Yeah, why not? Hey, uh, just want me to sit down. Yeah, yeah, just just I, I kind of am interested about talking to you about like the ticket market, and then we'll also be like, hey, does anyone need po tickets? Yeah. All right, all right. No, no, you, no, no. How are you? You're Fanny Pack Rock. I'm Fanny Pack Rock. That's right. You think that because it shows over his shit stops? All right. I know. I know the Rock's been out of the game for a little bit, but yeah, the Rock's been out of the game for a little bit. But you think because it shows over the shit stops? No. I didn't know. I didn't even think about it. Yeah. I didn't think about it. No. All right. What are we talking about? What is this? Uh, we're talking about tickets. Right you have any extra tickets? Uh, no. I got plenty of tickets. Oh. Oh. Well, it's yeah, funny you know. say that because he no, needs. You don't have extras, though. <laughs> oh, you need extras? No, nah, man. If you want to grab bro. this mic, if you don't mind holding that up. Yeah. 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 All right. So what's the, rock, what's, the, what's the rock? What's the rock feeling for tonight? What am I feeling for tonight? I just came to see Rhea. That's all. Oh. I came Dude, to see Rhea. Dude, she is... You know Rhea Ripley? No. <laughs> oh, come on. You don't have a Come clue. on. You like fat asses? Yeah. 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 You then like you got to see Ripley? Bailey. Yeah. All right. Is yeah. she yeah. a wrestler? Yeah. All right. Well, if you like fat asses, you got to see Bailey. But if you like... Beauty that you can't put into words, then you see Rhea. Y'all give okay. That's my mommy. Tonight. No, we no. got no tickets. We're trying no to help. We're trying to get some for you. Anyone got any extra tickets? Tickets, tickets, tickets. Hey, 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 help us out, will you? Hey, Anyone got any extras? Out here. We're looking for fat asses. Come on now. Where's Bailey? Has anybody seen Bailey? Men at work. Men at work. All right. Anyone got any extra tickets? Y'all on the radio? At once. Now we're on the thing called the internet. Okay. Yeah. Internet. 
Yeah. They have internet for computers now. Wow. Yeah. All right, well, I gotta get the word. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Of hey, anyone got any extra tickets? Hit them up. So, sir, let me ask you this. You're uh, you're here at WrestleMania. Are you a single guy or you got a beautiful lady at home? I got a wonderful wife at home. She's, she's a little sick, but she's she's at home. Oh, well, hopefully she feels yeah, better. Yeah, two kids that got into a fist fight as soon as I left. Yeah, that'll be a good life. <laughs> well, they're just getting yeah. in the cage, yeah. man. That's all it is. Yeah, you know. That's yeah. nice, man. And so dad's you, off the WrestleMania. So you head out dad's to the turtleneck and you're like, honey, you take care of it. I got I to gotta go to WrestleMania. So the turtleneck <laughs> on, pull the chain out. I was like, sorry, I gotta, baby. I got to put a fanny pack on, two belts <laughs> and a chain. Yeah, that's so, right. That's right. They know what's up. Sorry, honey. Feel better. Deal with the kids. Feel better. <laughs> I think I've got mania tickets. I'll see you later. That's incredible. I love that, dude. I can't That's wait right. to get dad to do the same thing. That's I right. do fucking love that. Yeah. Okay. That's so How do you sick. feel about that? Hi, hon. I feel great. I mean, the clouds are here, but who gives a shit? Yeah, but I feel yeah. like you're cheering for the final boss. You're not a co- you're not a Cody crybaby. <laughs> no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I mean, I, I I like the bad guy. You know. I do too, man. I like the bad yeah, guy. I'd like. Any, I'd, any, I'd anytime, anytime someone can beat the shit out of you mm-hmm. and say this blood is for your mama. Mm-hmm. And I can cheer. You're my kind of guy. I was yeah. rooting for LSU and Angel Reese. I fucking I'm tired of Caitlin Clark and Iowa. Like I love. Give me the bad guy. Give me the Fab Five. I'm me- a Patriots fan. Yeah, but I res- I, I don't hate Tom Brady. I respect. I, I've greatness. always liked Tom Brady. I've always I res- been a Tom Brady shut up, guy. Cody. That's a Cody. He's a Cody guy, baby. Don't let him uh, fool you. He's trying come to. On, come on, man. I'm a Catholic first and foremost. Uh, I, I'll let that one slide. But, I, I mean, I like the bad guy. Like, when Frank Lucas got arrested in American Gangster, I cried. I cried. The man, the man, the man killed thousands of people, yeah, yeah. but I cried when they took him yeah. down. He got a heart. Dude, yeah. when the Axis powers lost, he cried. Well, careful. Uh, you know, you know, I, told him, I told him I'd had it up to here. I got a mustache, dude. You got to be careful. Uh, Don't do this to Oh, me. the junkyard dog's here. Well, The Rock's got to sign out. I've got my jabroni friend over here who's giving me the eyebrow, so, you yeah. know, i got to go. Absolutely, but man. Can we get an eyebrow? Oh, that's amazing. That's incredible. How are you? Prediction. How are you? Huh? Prediction. Um, Jimmy's beating Jay. Okay. I think there's are kids in their class. <laughs> like, Jimmy said he's going to kick Jay's ass because he was dating Sabrina <laughs> for two weeks. <laughs> 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 it's like, whoa! That's a Cody cry, baby. <laughs> you want to sit down? You want to sit down on the podcast? Yeah, he's, a co- he's a Cody crybaby, so you can feel it, huh? I am a big Cody crybaby. I love Me. the old codester. You can what's just up, what's up on, brother? Just throw these on and then just uh, grab that microphone. How are you? There you go. Uh, yeah. Go on, go on Instagram I like live this. I like this. Yeah, go on Instagram live. Do whatever you got to do. Go check that kiddos, man. Uh, the right. kiddos. Who, uh, what's your name? Uh, Gabriella. Gabriella, the Cody crybaby. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Acknowledge me. How do you feel? How, do you, how are you going to feel when uh, Cody loses tonight and tomorrow? <laughs> Guys, don't even jinx it. Don't even jinx wow. it. You're not confident? Are you confident? You I'm confident if he wins. I'm going to be very happy, guys. Yeah. Yeah. So what's the prediction for tonight? What do you think? What happens tonight? What happens tomorrow? What's it look like? You know, I feel like all my prayers are going to be heard. Yeah. And everyone that I hope is going to win is going to win. Yeah. to the rest of the gods. Yeah. This means a lot to you. I can tell. Yeah. yeah. This that's is my awesome. first WrestleMania. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Have you followed it your whole life, your whole childhood, the, the whole time? Yeah. I mean, I just started ro- watching, like, wrestling with my dad, like, a couple years ago. Right there. <laughs> is he a big wrestling head? He's a big fan? Yeah. Oh. He watches a lot of, like, wrestling, like, Lucha Libre. You yeah. know what it is? Yeah. And we have a lot of masks at home. Like, that's why we came out here today. And, like, I'm really grateful for my dad because he took me here. Oh. And, you know. I can't make fun of a cry crybaby when, when they're, they're going to make me cry. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. It was like seven hours. We came from North Carolina. Oh, my God. You came all the way from North Carolina to get up here? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's yeah. We got dad of the year over yeah. here, man. <laughs> You're the best. Thank you. This yeah. guy rules, man. Yeah. That's incredible. Oh my, my dad never came to my basketball games. <laughs> Your dad's driving you to WrestleMania. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. It must be nice. Oh, <laughs> I'm so sorry. All right. Yeah. yeah. Go in there. Go have fun. Yeah, go yeah. have fun. Seriously, have a great time. <laughs> Thank you. All Worst right. of luck. Oh. Best of luck. Thank you. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Yeah, have fun. Go to Papa Squad? Talk a little WrestleMania? Yeah, man. Oh, here we go. This guy barely made a turn. This guy I love it. How you doing? Yes, sir. How you, how you feeling? Fine. This is my first um, WrestleMania. Is that Puerto Rico on the hat? Yes, it is. Bad bunny guy? Uh, a good guy. Big bunny guy? Yeah, he's all right. Rumors might be showing up tomorrow. I'll be there. <laughs> really? I hope so. You're here the whole weekend? You yeah, I came all the way from Worcester, Massachusetts. Hey, no kidding. My granddaughter surprised me. She had heard me say that um, on my bucket list, I would like to go to my first WrestleMania. I've seen them all on TV, yeah. on pay-per-views. 
And she made it happen. How incredible wow. is that? She made it happen. Jeez. Absolutely. She's incredible. What a sweet girl. How old is she? She's, She's like, 27. Great girl. Jesus, you're 27. What the fuck have you done for your grandfather? <laughs> At 27. Uh, <laughs> sometimes I, have, I text him. <laughs> I got 24 grandchildren. <laughs> what? And four great granddaughters. Oh, you my God. You got 24 God. grandchildren? Yes, sorry. God bless Jeez, them all. You got a football team. Yeah, I got a little football team going there, but <laughs> a lot of them already 18, 19, 20, so they're on the living their lives. You're here going solo dolo to WrestleMania by yourself? <laughs> By myself, we try to see if anybody could come, but everybody was busy or just yeah. they just couldn't afford it. Dude, yeah. I fucking and, love you know. going to places by myself. Yeah, it's so, nothing better. Yeah, so absolutely. now, on holidays and your birthday and stuff, one of the grandkids gets okay. you like a scarf, and you're well, like, oh, you it's know not what? WrestleMania my 2024. Grand, <laughs> my birthday is April 23, so this is an early birthday present from my granddaughter. Oh, no the yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, so she's number one in the world? So right now, she's <laughs> on, <laughs> on top of the hill. <laughs> yeah, she's yeah, yeah. she, she first born, so absolutely. You know. My God, she's stuck on it. She's getting the belt. She's getting the belt and the will. Yeah. yeah. Uh, everything. That, that's just one of fourteen. You got fourteen belts. Mm, sure. You have them like uh, hung up in the room. You have, like, oh, a I got a, like a, a glass case like four of them fits in it, and the rest of the cases on the wall. Real yeah. nice. Why'd you bring this bad boy? Yeah, I just said any mini mini mo, and because I just didn't know which one to choose. Yeah. One of them told me, just go and win the title from Seth and bring it home. No <laughs> kidding. And I just happened to have the title he has, so now I can go and brag it. Nice. What's your favorite WrestleMania moment? WrestleMania moment when um, the Ultimate Warrior became the champ. Got it. That was a long time ago. Yeah. It was exciting. Yeah. Who'd he beat? He beat, uh, what was it, I think, Macho Man? Macho Man? Something like that. With Hong Kong, it's, it's, it, with, with Hong Kong and it was title for title. Yeah. So he definitely won that that match. He had Dude, both titles. Dude, the Ultimate Warrior. The Ultimate Warrior was before my time, but mm -hmm. like... Dude, what a what, he was an, what an enigma! Like, yeah, he, what a, what he, a knew, he knew how to use that power. Yeah, he just he just needed to show muscle. He knew how to he knew how to use yeah. it. Unnatural power. Oh, that close line! I said that I wouldn't. I don't want to. If I get up for that, you better run. A lot of anabolic power. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. Unnatural. So, brother. Thank you. Go yeah, have man. fun. Yeah, thank seriously. Have thank a great time. Thank you for time. inviting me. I appreciate you it. You deserve it, man. Have thank a nice you. night. Dude, I appreciate the stories. All right. Awesome. Cheers. Dude, I better have grandkids like that. That's incredible. They better man. shower me with gifts. I just can't imagine. I, like, I made it as a joke, but the idea of, like, everybody knows she got Grandpa the best gift, and nobody's topping it. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> it's just, I don't know what else you could beat you WrestleMania. They live seven hours away. Uh, I will say, it's one of those things that you get as, like, a... If I got my dad tickets to something that's seven hours away, he's like, so I have to drive seven <laughs> hours? Like, that's Did you get the flight, too? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, I mean, truly, yeah. Then he's like, I gotta go to an airport. Yeah. You can't help these older gents. Yeah, go ahead. Hey, come on. Seat, come dude. on. Come on now. Dude, Ray Mysterio. Get your Lucha Leroy loving ass over here. We've been looking for you all fucking day, man. Oh, Yo, Stone Cold. Yo, he's got the knee brace and everything. <laughs> you want to sit down? <laughs> all right. You want to come on, don't Come on, one, come on, one question. <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 not this oh. guy. Oh, 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 no. oh, no. oh, 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 who that guy was. Yeah. <laughs> but let's just say he didn't have a bald head. <laughs> yeah, he's not like us, man. He's, he's not, not like, like you us, and I. brother. Yeah, it's bullshit. Yeah. What's your name? He's damn Name's Foster. Nick. How you Nick, doing? how are you? What's your name? My name's Rocco. Rocco? That's a Rocco move. Just yeah, stunning people. Rocco. In the middle of it. Stone Cold Standard. I will do it any day, anywhere. That guy right there is going to get stunnered in a second. If I'll, take, I'll take a stunner. Oh, yeah. I was about to say, you're I think you're going to have to show him the move. I'll take a damn stunner. Dude, any, dude, who would you, what historical figure would you stunner, dead or alive? Oh, God. A, a historical figure ever. Yeah. Anyone. Could, does it have to be a historical figure? Be I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with Abe Lincoln. Do you want what stunner? The hell? That's Lincoln. the tallest stunner of all time. Wait, pre or That's post true. assassination? When are you doing it? After the hit or before? <laughs> I don't think there's much of a difference here, maybe like two inches or three inches. I, I, I don't know. I, I don't murder people. A lot of but shot. All right, dead or alive? Any, anyone that hit the stone cold You can hit the stone on anyone. Oh, I was about to say, Albert Einstein, no question. <laughs> Guy's a nerd. The smartest One guy, guy saved ever going to stun him? <laughs> Guy's a nerd. Dude. No, no. He's a nerd. Yeah, he is a nerd, though. Don't nerds have to get stunned. Don't get seen. You got Technically, he's nerds no have to get stunned. Yes. 
but okay. they changed history. You That's know what I mean? Dude, dude, you guys are literally like trying to put, you guys are literally trying to paralyze like fuck him up. two of like Who the, the fuck's like this guy? most influential people. This guy yeah. right here, shut that uh, up. up. Oh, shut yeah, him up. Shut him up. Fight him. Fight him. Do something, will ya? Take a chair. Take a chair. Do something. No, there's no chair. Go. Go. Stop. No. No. Sure. It's nice. It's n it really feels like a real tailgate. I didn't know what the vibe would be like if people just keep getting drunker. You but doubted. Uh, I doubted. I did doubt. You doubted. I had a bit of a doubt. I don't know. I feel like you doubted too. Don't, don't count yourself out. You doubted just as I did. We're a couple <laughs> doubting ass ninnies over here. <laughs> By the way, Enigma earlier? Careful, brother. We're on YouTube. <laughs> I did see. What the hell was that I about? I saw the sign on it. I was like, oh, relax. Relax. I gotta. You wanna, do, you wanna come on? Come on. You wanna come on for you a second? You wanna second? come on? All right. I mean. Where do my glasses go? They're my only veil of escape that I have. Oh my god, dude! I really, really fucked up my hand jumping on the concrete. <laughs> yeah, but it was—you did. You looked agile as hell. That's actually one of the best things you could get on camera. But the one dude beat me to it, so now I was kind of look like a fucking asshole. I disagree. I think he was doing it. It wasn't a sanctioned tap. You—you you were the one who was actually controlling the entire thing. Don't let him talk you out of it, dude. He got there first, but you got there better. Holy shit! Holy shit! Guys, want to take a seat? Want to come hang out? Take a seat? Come on, we don't anything. Y Get over here, dude. Yeah. Do you, no do you acknowledge him? Um, Nick, absolutely not. Are you Cody Crybaby? Huh? Are you Cody Crybaby? I'm Cody Crybaby. Yes, you're please Cody take Crybaby. a seat. I'm a Roman hater. You're I'm Cody Crybaby. I don't know about Cody Crybaby. You're Cody take Crybaby. A seat, dude. We need you down here. I don't know now. about Cody Crybaby, but I'm a Roman hater. Spoken like a true Cody, Cody Crybaby. Come on. Excuse me? Yes. Sorry. Hello. <laughs> okay, sorry to interrupt you. <laughs> let, me, yeah. let, me say, let me say this now to the United States of America. I'm a Roman hater, and I have, <laughs> I have no shame for it at all. Such yeah. a beta. I hope Stone Cold shows up and <laughs> kicks his Donald ass Trump and rocks no. ass. No. America. Are we getting a Trump impression here? Uh, <laughs> America. Are you, do you guys know each other? Oh, no. Barely. barely. Oh. So you're dating? I don't we know just, him. We just met. Oh, sweet. Really? Please, no. Oh, first date. How's it going so far? How's the date first going? Date. Yeah, she, she's a rock fan. I'm a Stone Cold fan. That's how it's going. Oh. That's how it's going. Ooh. Really now? Yeah. Does that cause some stripes and fighting or anything? Oh, we're going to A wee bit. A wee bit. Yeah. Do Dolphin you have a tampon on your head? Like, what the fuck she, is going she, yeah. on? It's for Women's History Month. I've been wearing this is the it? since uh, February. Oh, that was last March. Give, so. me, give me some history yeah. on that fucking tampon. Name a woman. Uh, Name a woman. woman. My yeah, mom won't ever show the fuck up. Uh, <laughs> Kelly. Name a woman that wore Kelly, that. Kelly, Kelly. Kelly, my mom. No, uh, name a no, woman no, that we no. know. Hag your mom over here and yeah. let's talk. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying to hang 10. But I, I, I'm excited to see, like, the first uh, WrestleMania couple. We haven't had any couples here yet tonight. What do you mean, couples? Uh, we just don't, again, I know you guys are on your first date, but rebels? I think we see... We're a young, young couple. Young couple. <laughs> we trying to do a, a triple tag yeah. team back here? <laughs> Describe what you're Somebody's saying. Somebody's going home with a crutch. Yeah. How about that? Hey, okay, guys, what the hell? I thought it's family friendly, guys. It's like a no, super no, PBS no, kids. No, 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 no. So who puts the championship belt on who after? <coughs> yeah. It's me. I wear the belt. <laughs> yeah. I wear the belt. I can assure you I wear the belt. <coughs> it's me. Nice, nice. I'm that bitch. Oh, my God. We didn't even know we had that bitch on here. The yeah, 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 wait. <laughs> That's awesome. I'm that bitch. <laughs> That's crazy. We've been looking for you the entire day. I know, and I arrived. Yeah. What's up? Can I have that beer? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> some guy left it here. Give me, give me some. Yeah, give me the whole beer. thing. How about that? Give the beautiful lady. Give the beautiful lady a beer. Yeah. Let, let me, let me whisper in yeah, this. Slug yeah, slug it. Hey, slug it. 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 You guys can't tell by slug it. Do you want us to open because of your nails? You don't want to screw the nails up. I know. They're press on. They're press on. Yeah, do ASMR. Do ASMR while you do it. He's videotaping me. Yeah, that's well, that's scary. Don't say it like that. <gasps> oh my god, I'm gonna try my best. Yeah, she's you gonna can, get you know, two you know and that's gonna be it. it. I can do my best. Yeah, not my best move. It's the hottest thing <laughs> we got I tried, I tried. <laughs> All right, fucking I'm throw right. that shit over here. You've been babysitting that. <sighs> <laughs> Is it a family show or can I swear? Can I swear on here? Absolutely. Give me that fucking shit, dude. Well, yeah, don't get greedy, dude. <laughs> I am greedy. <laughs> you give next. That. Give me that. Okay. Give me that rolling rock. Come on. Come on, come on. What are you most excited for today? Yeah. Myself. <laughs> what about
about yourself excites you there at WrestleMania? <sighs> Me drinking beer. <laughs> okay. I can see that. I totally agree with that. That's Come on. I, I bought him tickets. <gasps> and I'm here to have a good time. Not a long time. Yeah. So he, she bought the tickets, huh? She did indeed. What a great... Is she that a gift or a birthday gift? It was a gift. Yeah, it was. Oh, that's a great gift. Well done. I know. Girlfriend I know. Hide me up. Hide me up. Absolutely. That's incredible. Go, girlfriend. Go, <laughs> <laughs> um, I really, really, really don't want she this going anymore. She makes you laugh Wait till you get to know her. She ain't gonna make you laugh anymore. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? You know exactly what I mean. Um, what do you mean? I'm gonna choke slam you. Uh, That's what? what? I mean. <laughs> uh, no, seriously, table. right now, I mean, the yes to go nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> she don't know what she's talking about. She don't know what she's talking about. What do you mean? It's true. It's, I mean, it's a good question. <laughs> we sp. Yeah, peace out. Have a good night. I'll see you. I'll see you tomorrow, we, girl. We out here. I'll see you tomorrow, girl. We out here. That's been the episode. And ladies we gotta and gentlemen, that's the night. That's how you do a podcast, baby. See ya. That's how you do it. I'm sorry. That's how you do it right you there. Okay? Yeah. You couldn't pay for Wait, shit like that, myself? could you? <laughs> you couldn't pay for that. I can't hear you loud and clear. Can anybody hear me? Can anybody hear yeah, me? Yeah, they can hear you, but they can't <laughs> see you on the goddamn ground. <laughs> R.I.P. You, are you okay? You're all right? Good. I'm okay. Good. <laughs> I made it. I made, made it. it. I don't think you're making it in, sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you that much. She better make it in. She I got my back. tickets. She I better make back. it in. <laughs> so called Steve Fallen, lady. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was good. Are these there. coupons? Yeah, yeah please yeah. take it. Take <gasps> as many as you need. Yeah, you can hold on to it. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> right. I wasn't here. Ah, yeah. You're a superstar. That sounds like tomato soup. Holy you know what I'm talking shit. about. Shit. That is, wow. That sounds like tomato soup. You know what I I'm wasn't saying? I was here. You were not here. You were never here. Two for six. That's right. Apple juice? <laughs> We yep. in this bitch. You see what I got to deal with, gentlemen? I mean, she you probably got a great so. guy. Yeah. 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 I'm in a handicap match as it is. No, nah, you got a great <laughs> You guys are a great couple. I'm two on, I'm two on one already. No, nah, you're, you're, you guys are going for another personality Excuse against me. me. <laughs> I got two on one. No, go ahead. Sorry. Talk your shit. Say something. Excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just, can you go? Acknowledge me. <laughs> oh, yeah, give him the ASMR. Acknowledge me. Can someone give me a sip? Speak up a little bit. We're not talking to the... Want to come on? Come on on, man. Yeah. Please, dude. My guy. Dude, you you got like 50 pounds on the shoulders right there, man. Take a seat. Throw what these you on got, if you like don't mind. Three of them? Jeez. Uh, strap the hell up. Yeah, I got Austin's. Hello. My God. The champ champ. My new baby. If one of y'all want to hold... Hey, look here. That here one's here. Yeah, yeah, we'll make I'll sure hold one. Uh, oh, my God. That's got some weight to it. Let's put this on. Yeah, man. Oh, can I hold hey, this in front of you if you don't mind? Thank awesome. you, man. Oh, man. Yeah. Look at this. Woo! What's going on, fellas? How are you? I'm feeling damn amazing. Yeah. Yeah. I got to watch my mouth because I don't know if this is PG you or can, not. You curse. Say whatever you want. I'm feeling fucking amazing. Oh, you can't say that. I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, quick story yeah. before I get my ass in there. First WrestleMania I ever watched. WrestleMania 22. The first match I saw was, Russell, was Rey Mysterio against Kurt Angle and Randy Orton. My father had showed me that. And he said, son, this is what you're going to love. Another... Another side story, on June 29th, 1998, I was born the same night Stone Cold had won this back from Kane after the first blood match. So I was going to grow up and be a damn Austin fan, of course. Yeah. Favorite wrestler? Cena. Uh, I've been wanting to go to this ever since I was a child, and now that it's finally back in Philadelphia, I can finally say, Mama, I'm here, I'm at Lincoln Financial Field, and I'm going to have some fucking fun at WrestleMania. Let's go. Tonight and tomorrow, and I'll be back on Monday for Raw after Mania. What? That's gonna be damn lit. What? 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 I said. A bird? That I'm. What? Gonna. What? Be. What? Back. What? In. What? Philadelphia. What? Love you. you. How many beers we have in here? I'm gonna have one beer. And then I'm gonna have another. Uh huh. Another. Uh huh. Another. Yes, sir. Another. What? Another. What? Another. What? Another. What? Another. What? Another. What? And a Bloody Mary. Okay. What? And I hope his ass shows up too, because I would love to see any and everybody, and I mean any and damn everybody, catch a fucking Stone Cold Stunner in Lincoln Financial Field. God and that's bless. the bottom damn line, because the Texas Rattlesnake fucking said so, boys. What? Listen, man, I came out this bitch with three goddamn belts. I was not playing. This is a boyhood dream yeah. that I'm living for the first time in my life. It's incredible. And, th and they're here. 
When you step foot inside of there, what's the what's the feeling? What are you feeling? Is there gonna be tears? I, yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. I am absolutely definitely gonna cry. This yeah. is something special to me. For 25 years, they have not been back in Philadelphia. Yeah. Yeah. And you're telling me that I'm about to, in about 30 to 45 minutes. I know that's a long ass line. 70,000 people are about to have fun in the city of brotherly love. Yeah. For WrestleMania. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, that's incredible. If you would have, if you would have told me that WrestleMania was gonna be back. In Philly, at that, the last time they were here was Rock versus Austin 2. Mm -hmm. That was 24 years ago, right? That was 24 years ago. If you're telling me that they would have been here, I would have called you a damn liar. I would have called all three of you a damn liar. But yeah, we didn't even know each other yet, too, which has been crazy. It, which is even crazy. Yeah. So the fact that they're back, first of all, shout out to Triple H. Shout out to all the wrestlers for this. Shout out to you guys for being here as Thank well, you. to have fun here as well. Like, mm -hmm. this is for all of us. This is for these people that's walking in. This is for people like myself. This is people... Th this is for people like you. Guys. I'm sorry that I'm stuttering. I am no, you're fine. so you're damn so excited. excited. Yeah. I'm excited for you. I can't yeah. fucking wait. Like, for you to get this is absolutely <laughs> amazing. This is for yeah, them well, too. Like this is for everybody. That's like this everybody. is <laughs> this is this is monumental. For her? This is uh, this is for her too. For him. This is what? Monumental. This is for the Hulk of fucking maniac that's right here as yeah, well. Brother. Yeah, brother. This is for all of us. Yeah. yeah. And I'm I probably am gonna cry. Good. Probably about after Cody wins the belt. I hope he wins. Yeah. I hope he wins because the tribal chief might just come out and whoop some ass tonight. Hopefully Solo doesn't come and chop his uh, neck out. See, all right, if we're going to do predictions, we're going to do predictions? Are we going to do predictions? Let one rip, dude. All okay. right, so prediction for night one, it's going to definitely end up being a bloodline rules match for night two. Uh, Rhea versus, uh, goddamn, Rhea versus Becky. I got to rock out with Mommy, of course. I got to rock out with Mommy. Uh, for the... What six or eight man ladder match? Yeah. Hoping hot take the Hardy Boys are coming back tonight. Ooh, dude. Ooh. Oh, dude. Oh, that's a good man. one. I didn't expect hot that. Hot take the oh. Hardy Boys are, are they, coming back tonight. They off the drugs? I hope his brother is. Yeah, the one. The one's a little. <laughs> I hope Jeff is. Jeff, if you're watching, yeah. big fucking fan. Love you, brother Nero. Uh, they're gonna come back. Uh, one set of raw tags are definitely going to the Awesome Truth. The other one. It's cliche to say the Hardy Boys are going to come back and win. Yeah. So I'm going to go with Austin and Grayson Waller. Let's see, another damn match. We got what brother versus brother. Yeah, Busos, right? Yeet! <laughs> yeah, what's the yeet? Yeet, I'll be honest with you, I have no idea. <laughs> I, I, Everybody I, just I, shouted yeet at the Everybody just been shouting yeet, and yeah. I know what yeet means, but at the same time, I don't know yeah. what yeet means because, you know, back in the Vine days, everybody said yeet when you were throwing something, yeah, and yeah. now 100%. we're saying yeet at WWE. Yeah, the There's crowd was chanting, I know Roman said no yeet, <laughs> so I know. Yeah, none of that. Now, I got a, I got a quick question. Before Absolutely. We won't hold you up too long. So you walk in there, getting teared up, totally makes sense. I'd be the same way if, like, the Sixers were in the finals. Absolutely. Now, how long can you cry for, and what type of cry is it? Is it one of the cries? where you kind of like tear up a little bit, hit yourself in the chest no. a couple of times? Or no. is it one of those like for real? This is a for real boo-hoo, I'm living my boyhood dream Let's since go. I was a little kid sitting Let's in front go. of that fat screen staticky television oh watching Rey God. Mysterio hoist up that damn belt, that beautiful damn belt that that man is holding on his wonderful shoulder. Yeah. And you look damn good with it, you look damn good with it, and you also look damn good with the Big Eagle belt as well. This is my favorite. So this it's going to be like belt. a no Sean Moreno the national anthem cry. Man, I'm going to be bawling my tears out like oh, the one guy in that th in that football meme when, who was it? It was the Chiefs, and the dude just had the slow no tear just rolling down that was, his face. No oh, yep. oh. Just rolling down his face. <laughs> I'm bawling dude, I'm tears. No Sean. no Sean Moreno had tears literally <laughs> just dripping. <laughs> no, I, remember, I remember that meme, yeah. <laughs> and then Nick Seriani cried in the Super Bowl, and then he lost. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. I heard you talk about do. the belts. Did you have it? I must have misheard. Did you have a favorite belt? Did I have a favorite belt of all time? Oh yeah. I like this belt right here. I'm holding right now. It's my so favorite one right here. I have three of my favorite belts. That is one of them. The spinner is number two. I couldn't get my hands on the original big gold, but that one they'll do. That's my favorite belt that they have released in the last seven years. That's one of my wrestling. more favorite ones. The new ones. The new ones I'm not really cool with. The I new like ones that are one. all the same. And when yeah, they finally split colors. the difference, that that's something new. I got that thing expedited shipped. Expedited shipped for what an extra fifty-five dollars just so I can have it here with me. Nice. Hey man, Triple man. Crown champ. Love my it. name is Bernard Flowers. I want to say thank you to you guys for having no, me. Dude, thank the you. Best. I want to say so thank you to you. I definitely on. will. I don't, you don't hear much. Yeah. But I'm on. And let's go to WrestleMania, belt. shall we? Yes, sir. Oh. This was awesome. Dude. Oh man. God. Well, how do you want to finish it? What, what was your peak? Uh, the peak. I'll tell you what. I. Uh, it was a constant peak. There was no bell curve. God, you're such a fucking dork. <laughs> <laughs> what was
was your peak there? My peak, was, my peak was that guy getting stunned, and then the other guy getting a, 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 an elbow dropped on him, and me counting to three. From a genuine peak, uh, the guy from Singapore. You travel 30 hours for anything, but you could tell how fucking sick this shit is. All right. Well, hey, we're getting out of here. Shout out to everybody that came on. We appreciate everybody, except for the Cody Cry Babies. Yes. Let's go. You're the, you're a Cody Cry Baby. I am now. I'm gonna look him up and just like him from now on. Yeah. Yeah. I um, like that. Shout out to the Tribal Chief. I only acknowledge him and him only. I can't wait till he wins tonight and he wins tomorrow and he sends the Cody Cry Babies packing. That's the podcast. Subscribe, like, uh, do all that stuff for us, and uh, we will talk to you next time we see you. I think we're doing an eclipse next. Do a clip? Oh yeah, we are. We got Monday. Monday we'll be there watching an absolutely transformative event. And I'll tell you what, the Eclipse Wrestling—it's real to me. God damn it. <laughs>